I started out with the concept late in 2009, where I was working on a capstone design project in my senior biomedical engineering program. And we were assigned the task of designing a, a mobility device for a small boy in Kenya named Ishmael, because he couldn't use his wheelchair on the rough terrain that was in Africa. And the problem with wheelchairs over there is that the terrain does not support wheelchairs because the front wheel of the wheelchair basically gets stuck. And so we wanted to create an attachable hand cycle that would be able to alleviate some of that problem. But allow him to become independent and travel to school by himself. So we built him an attachable hand cycle that basically attaches to his wheelchair and it turns it into a hand propelled tricycle. He's doing very well. He's uh, still going to school and uh, he's greatly benefiting from our uh, hand cycle. So we're looking to convert the metal pieces that we uh, initially built the first prototype to more sustainable materials. And one of the logical materials was bamboo, which turns out to be a very interesting material to use that grows in many parts of the world, including Africa. And it grows very fast, about a foot a day. There's about 1,500 species. We learned a whole bunch about bamboo that we never knew before. It opened up a whole new dimension to our program. And it's just one example of probably 50 or 60 devices that we've designed and built and have in different countries in Africa. But Boo Good was an evolution of that design. And one of the things that we're hoping to see in our program is that our students can take their design projects uh, that are real world projects and able to move them out into the real world customers that need these devices. And so we wanted to do something that would attract a lot of people and that's why we chose Bamboo Bicycle. Because during the process that we were researching bamboo, we were looking into a lot of how bikes were constructed from bamboo. And so we thought it would be a great idea to start in a place like ASU where there's a great bike community here. So our, our whole business plan is we sell you a bike and for each bike we sell, it'll directly fund the donation of an attachable hand cycle to someone in need. Um, but we're not just donating the hand cycles because that doesn't support their local economy over there in Kenya. So what we're doing is we're setting up a workshop over in Kenya where Kenyan workers will actually build the hand cycles. So what you're doing by buying a bike is supporting giving jobs to them and also supporting donating a hand cycle to someone in need. Well, the future of Bugut Bicycle currently is to basically expand and let as many people know about it as much as possible. Yeah. We're not just a bamboo bicycle company, but we're also a company that is trying to do good out there. And so research plays a really big role in helping us improve some of our ideas that, that we have. I can think of no better way to train students in these kinds of efforts where they understand the importance of their, their training and how they can make a difference in the world.